What you're doing right now is you are just, you're not giving her specific commands where she has to be precise. What, say how happy she is. Yeah. What, like, excellent, right there. So what you just did there, what you're doing is imitating having a good time with her. You're out for a leisure time. So it doesn't matter that she started because you're not doing a heel or a foot. But do you see what you just did there? Now just stop. Stop walking for a second. No. Now. Exactly. So you're teaching her just because you stopped doesn't mean she can jump on you. But you didn't tell her to sit. You didn't tell her to down. She didn't have to stay. But all you're trying to do is now you're trying to imitate what you want real life to actually yeah, look like. Right. I want to be able to hang out with you. Yeah, right. I don't need you to do But if you start to wander off, I want to know that if I say no, you're going to come back, which is what just happened there. That's, what, that's the point you're at. So in other words, think you are now at that level of what did you really want out of dog training? What, right there. What did you really want out of life? You want a, you want a best bud that you can trust. And that's what you have now. And she's not trying to attack me, and she can be off leash in the room with me. In fact, she has not growled at me for like the last bunches of lessons. Yeah, right. Which, once again, what would you have thought if I would have told you I expect your dog to be off leash in this room with me? That she's not come after you. Come after me. Come so right there, once again, she's not under a precise command, so she's allowed to wander. You just have to reel her in when you feel like it. Right there. That is a perfect of what our final goals were. Excellent.